You guys been using the Fresh, Amazon Fresh, the grocery delivery service by the world's largest internet retailer? I have, and two things are certain. One, there's no way they can keep prices this low. Something's gotta give eventually. <laughs> they just can't, my grocery bill's been cut in half. So there's no way this is sustainable. But for now, it's great. Two, they use way too many of these green totes to deliver stuff. I mean, look at this, one tote, all for three pairs. Three pairs in one tote. The end result is that even if you put in a relatively small grocery order, sometimes you can end up drowning in green totes. So today I'm gonna to show you how to consolidate six of these green totes down into one single tote, and we're not throwing anything away ourselves. We're not using our own garbage for the ice, the cardboard, the bags, anything. All of it's going back to Amazon. Six totes down to one. Let's dance. So we're mainly gonna to have to deal with stuff like ice. Let's set that aside for now. And these gray insulator things are bulky, but I have a trick for them. Getting these down to a manageable size is really the key to this entire process. So we'll start with one empty tote, which we'll use to store all the other totes. Uh, so once you have a second tote empty, it folds up flat like so and can slide right into the first tote. Cardboard, that falls flat, so not a huge burden there. And more bags and more bulky gray things. So fast forward and we've got, we want to empty everything. We've got five totes consolidated down to one and a whole pile of bags and ice and gray insulators that we're gonna to need to cram into the tote. Here's where the trick for the bulky gray things comes in. You fold them into thirds like so, and then you apply as much weight as possible, which forces air out of them. They'll eventually collapse down to about a quarter of their regular thickness, at which point you can shove them into a tote with everything else. So I'm just gonna like literally sit on all of these until all the air is out, and then I can fit them into the tote. You find a few nooks and crannies for the ice packs. You slide the cardboard pieces in among the other totes. And all you're left with are plastic bags which crumple up into nearly nothing. So there you go, six totes down to one. Then you put this on your doorstep and they'll pick it up when they deliver the next order. I know you're probably saying to yourself, Doug, I notice you're wearing workout clothes in this video and you've got a killer body, so did you just come from a really intense workout or are you going to a really intense workout after this video? No, <laughs> that's the workout. I edited a lot of that out, but it is hard work and once you get it into one tote, it, that tote is about 700 pounds, which makes for a fun experience uh, for the delivery guy picking it up who probably slips a disc or has a hernia thinking it's just one single tote and there's 700 pounds of crap in there. What a fun story to tell his buddies back at the warehouse about swinging by the old Amoth joint and slipping a disc.